All right. Um, I'm going to do this a bit weird. Mainly because I don't have a screen recorder as I'm making this upload. However, I'm going to narrate the game <laughs> as much as I can. Um, so what we're looking at is... Uh, Raichu, Spirit Tomb, um, Charcoal, Lapras, Twacky, and Steelix. Um, looking back at the team, the things I was kind of worried about that I was gonna say didn't make the cut, but that's that's not entirely true. Uh, <laughs> but rather, mods I worry about. Uh, just gonna send up this team again. Uh, yeah, Buffalant and Altaria were mods, and Duition were mods I was kind of scared of. Also, was kind of scared, and I'll be honest, I was kind of scared of uh, uh, Swirlix being a mod that can potentially throw me some issues. Um, <laughs> mainly with uh, stick web, but as a whole, I like this. And I'm gonna lead off with Kangaskhan or Falsetto, as she should be able to pressure this team quite nicely. Um, it's a bit weird, like I said. Uh, I'll see how I adjust this or if I re record this in a way that makes sense. But um, we tried to get each other to battle for uh, what was that? I'll, <laughs> I'll be honest. I'll try to get into battle for um, roughly an hour. Um, so leads off with Volga the Shark Hole. Uh, so we have a good lead-ish. Uh, you can set up rocks will be definitely frustrating. But we have a really solid earthquake. Yeah, we actually took him out. Wow. Wow, alright. It's a good start, definitely. Um, Twacky probably comes in here, and if so, then yeah. Grass the search. And what? Defense race? That's actually not ideal. Um can I send him Miasma, male because of the intimidate. Um let's see, sword stance. That's not annoying. Toxic here. Did not expect that actually. That's kinda cool. Now, if I can carry him toxic while he keeps salt stancing, may maybe I can pressure him somewhat. Keep salt stancing. Um, because now I can just send in Oyabora and uh, at least the Grassic Light should be resisted. Yeah. <laughs> Not great, but uh, I've done worse. Uh, from here, I'll paint split. Acrobatics. Wow, took me out straight out. Nice. <laughs> Wow, I did not expect that. Huh. Wow. Okay, cool. Not gonna lie, that threw me off quite a lot. Gonna send in Miasma again. And then send in Alderis, I think. Wow, yeah, this is... Um, this got rougher. All of a sudden. Because I think Grassy Light is a good neutral play. Maybe knockoff. Yeah, it took that like a champ. So no more of that. Acrobatics, good neutral hit. Got it to Rocky Helmet and a lot of residuals. Not as much as I wanted to. Uh, but it dies next turn, so acrobatics would probably the followed hit. Um, yeah, spikes. Um, knock off the, at least it didn't take us out, we had one has it up, so... You know, overall, this is one of the worst situations ever, so... Tip, I tipping off to my opponents here, that was... Um, that was rough. Alright. I like that set, though. The, the extra defense kind of threw my team off completely. The only positive point now is that uh, really nothing is positive anymore. <laughs> um, could I send in Alderis this? Volt switch is quite safe. Um, no way is physical. Let's see, Volt switch, I resist that. We outspeed everything. Barring Lapras, maybe. Uh, gonna go for a Ice Beam. Yeah, wow. Whoops. Maybe not. Um, let's see. Uh, 
Right, bring in Falsetto and uh, go over and Bandit Drain Punch. That's a scarfed bastard. <laughs> no wonder it did so much. <laughs> you know what? I appreciate that. That was awful. <laughs> oh, this is getting worse. All right, so... Like, Steelix comes in, has body press, which is annoying. Um, what do I switch in here? Like, I like Kangaskhan in the endgame. Probably sending Dondrick, try to stomach a hit. See body press. Yeah, there's a lot. Um Sending me ask my own out. Spirit Tomb. Ah, awful. Bring in Falsetto. Let's see, Don Willow goes back to Steelix. Right, this time a drain punch. Yeah, do plenty. Let's see, Potter Press will do also plenty. Let's see, the drain punch did what? Four to five percent, so we definitely aren't in range. Unfortunately. Bottom press is an absolute kill. Ah, oh, Jesus. Yep, keeps body pressing, that's fine. Get Rocky Helmet, which is great. At least now he's in range. Um, yeah, Saxet, great. Hmm. Raichu comes in again. Question is, right? I sack this. I actually stomach that hit, which was definitely incredible. Um, good for me, ish. It depends on the end game, honestly. Um, He stays in though. Ooh. He dies to Stealth Rock, isn't he? He dies to those Stealth Rocks. Come on, Falsetto. Bring Punch back. He could have Sucker Punch, and if so, then that's gonna be rough. Um, I think he dies to Spikes. Let's see, great, some good recovery. Willow is definitely unfortunate. Let's see, how much did Drain Punch do? Could probably follow that up with another Drain Punch anyway. I think he's in range for... Yeah, he had Sucker Punch. Like, I was expecting him to have it. <laughs> Alright, clear off. Please, please die to rocks or spikes. Oh, <laughs> oh clutch. Okay, okay, I'll be honest here. Goki, fuck man, you did. Yeah, you did good. 
I was way out of my depth in two matchups. Scarf Lapras and Grass is Seed Twacky just broke my team apart. Oh, it gets, I get brief, broke my team apart. Uh, the only like misplay he did, or not misplay, but the 50 50 got wrong was the Spirit Tomb. Had he switched in Spirit Tomb, um, in contrast to the situation we got, um, like um, because he had Sucker Punch, I was in range of dying by that. Uh, Mag Punch got in him range was incredible and definitely paved the way for, the, for my victory. There is no doubt that my opponent played a um, lot stronger than I did. And me coming out on top is honestly luck. The spikes mattered. And um, yeah, what else can I say? I hope I can kind of edit this game in a good way. Um, that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. Make sure to check out my opponent's Goki's side, side of this battle. As I'm sure he had a really thrilling tides of emotions. And I clearly had too. But yeah. Uh, yeah, what a game. Well done. <laughs> anyway, guys, take care.